particular actuator is made by Kinetrol. It's a pneumatic actuator, which means it's air operated, and it's double acting, meaning that we put air on one side to open the valve, or we'll put air on the other side to close the valve. The way we do that is by putting our air supply into this device here. This is a dual acting four-way solenoid valve. So we have our air supply. We've got two coils, one that'll open the valve, one that'll close the valve. And then the exhaust comes out here, which is adjustable. For this particular assembly, we've adjusted the valve so the full stroke operation is about 60 seconds. And then at the end of the full stroke, you'd like to get indication back at the main control panel if the valve is in a fully open or fully closed position. That's done with this device up here, which you see is coupled to the actuator. This is our limit switch. Right now, the limit switch is showing in the open position, which matches the disc, is in the fully open position. And inside of this limit switch enclosure are a set of contacts that the owner will wire to, and that will give them indication that the valve is either fully open or fully closed.